hey guys welcome back to my channel so it's been a little bit since I've done a grocery haul um, I believe the last video that you guys have seen is my Disney collections so my ears um, I do have a whole I guess kind of little series of our trip to Walt Disney World I am gonna get that up I still need to start working on that um, but I actually wanted to get this grocery haul up it's kind of an impromptu one hair is you know kind of whatever I just threw on some quick makeup um, I'm just in a tank top um, but I wanted to show you guys mainly because I went to Stater Brothers this morning and I spent $330 um, I do not care to shop at Stater Brothers. I do feel like they are a bit pricey, um, but it's close to us. I honestly intended on going and just getting a few things, but it turned into $330. So let me flip you guys around and I'll show you guys what I got. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little overview of kind of what I got. Now, I will say there's a couple items right here I did not get today. I actually got them at Target, but they were just sitting here in a bag. So I was like, okay, I'll just show you guys that too. But I got all of that, and then if I go over there, all of that. So, again, $330 for these groceries. Um, so we'll start with the stuff that I got at Target. Um, I don't remember when I went to Target. So today's Sunday... I think I went to Target maybe Thursday-ish. Um, but I knew that I was going to be starting a diet. So that's not part of it. Let me push that out of the way. Um, I got these. Now, I love beef jerky. Um, me and buns are really big on beef jerky. And that's kind of one of the things that I miss when I'm on a diet. So I did find these. I actually found something very similar at Albertsons. And it's 70 calories per serving, and the bag only has one one serving. Oh no, serving size one ounce. How many ounces in here? Okay, so it actually has two servings. So 140 calories for this whole bag is not bad at all. Um, although I do want to check the one at Albertsons now because I thought it was one bag with 70 calories. Um, but still, again, 140. That's normally like my snack. So I've got that. Um, I did get these, so I'm going to change how I do things. Um, I had been doing one of these for breakfast and like a hard-boiled egg, but I'm going to go back to my original diet. Um, if you guys don't know, I was on a diet last year for about seven months, and I had lost 50 pounds. And I was pretty strict, but I could still have, you know, a couple things here and there that was in my calories. So this... I, I don't know if I'm going to go back to doing this. Um, I just got these little naan breads. That's going to be for when I make spaghetti. And then I got a timer um, because hopefully if I get to it, I'm going to do a like a decorate video, how I decorated for Christmas. Um, and I have these little mini, Mickey Mouses that light up. So I have needed one more. So now on to Stater Brothers. I got some eggs, 18 count, and I like to get the extra large eggs. These are extra large, yeah, so extra large eggs. I got some Capri Suns. These are for today. Um, I had bought Capri Suns last week, and they disappeared. <laughs> so the kids drank them. I'm not going to lie. I did intend on, you know, like some of them being for me, um, but I think I got one. Um, we did get a milk. We got a reduced fat milk. Um, for the most part, everybody in the house, except for Pete, is on a diet. We do try to give her some healthier options. Um, but I got that. And then this bread is for me. It's only 40 calories a slice. I do have regular bread that we've already purchased for everybody else because they don't like whole wheat. Um, I got some... Hot dog buns, now they're not going to be for hot dogs. I actually could not find the bread that I use to make pizzas. Um, so these were the biggest things I could find. So I'm gonna make those for buns today. Got some tortillas. I just realized last night I was gonna make a quesadilla. I don't have any tortillas. So just wanted to have these on hand. Again, we are trying to diet, so I don't know how much of it we're gonna use. Okay, sorry, I had to take a little break there. Um, as you guys probably heard, my phone's going off and Buns wanted me to let the dog out. So I did get three boxes of these, um, the ramen soups. 
when I went into Stater Brothers, these were like the main thing that were gone. So they had maybe six of these and then that was about it. They had a couple individuals, but Albert, um, my stepson, he likes to eat these. He, I don't know, I think he's trying to lose weight, but he's drinking like protein and I can show you because it's actually right here in front of me so this is not part of the haul but I'll just show you what he's doing so he's got this peanut butter and we got this at Aldi he does the peanut butter he does a banana he does spinach and then he does this whey protein now I don't know a ton about protein I do know that like the protein drinks that I got can substitute a meal um, so that's what I intended it on doing but I don't know. I think he thinks that maybe he's going to lose weight by doing it. And I tried to explain to him that you can replace a meal, but that's the purpose of it. Like to replace a meal. He still eats his normal meals. So I don't know. Um, moving on. I got some whole grain spaghetti. And I'm sorry if I feel like, or if you guys feel like I'm having a hard time breathing. I'm kind of talking a little bit fast. So I am. Um, but buns... He doesn't do the diet like I do. Um, I'm a little bit more stricter. So with him, I do try to give him some of the things he likes and maybe make better choices. So I got that for him. And then if you guys have been following me or you follow my Instagram, you guys know I love Red Bull. I love the sugar-free. I think it's like one can is 10 calories. So stocked up on those. This was a good buy. So this is a 24 pack. It was $33. But if you get the 12 pack, it's $20. So this was definitely a good buy. Um, I got some cookie dough. I'm actually gonna make these today. Um, Ben's has been asking me for cookies for a long time. He likes homemade cookies. And I don't mean like make them yourself, but he just likes when we bake them. So I'm gonna make those right now. I got some string cheese. These aren't the ones I prefer. I prefer the 50 calorie string cheese. But every time I go to the stay Brothers, they never have them. So these were 70, a lot better than the 90 calorie ones. So I got those. And then Olive Garden Light Italian Dressing. I really like this dressing. It's not terrible if it would focus. I don't know if it's going to focus. I feel like I do this all the time. Anyways, there we go. 30 calories for two tablespoons. Um, I don't know what I wanted this for, but I feel like I see a lot of recipes with it. So I just grabbed it just in case I come across a recipe I want to do. Um, it's the fire roasted diced tomatoes with garlic. So I got that. And then I have never tried this before. I will say I do have, I think it's Rayo's pizza sauce. I haven't used it yet, but I'm actually going to use it today. But I got the vodka sauce, and then once I get over to the other side, I think I got another, like, four cheese sauce or something. But I hear, and here I go, like, losing breath again. Um, I hear this is actually, like, the best sauce out there. It is pricey. I think I've seen it at Walmart for, like, 8 or $9. But Stater Brothers had, if you use your phone number, if you're signed up with their, like, rewards type pro program, um, $2 off. So I think I spent $4.99 on these. So I'm excited to try these. Now, Buns is a big tuna person. He likes albacore. Um, he thinks it's healthy, <laughs> but the way that he eats it, it's, it's really not. He eats it with mayonnaise, corn, tomatoes, pepper, and onion. Um, but it's, you know, a lot better than some of the other decisions that we make. So I got two of these. You'll see it right there. And then I've got some spicy jalapeno refried beans. Um, I like these. These are easy when you're making, like if you do like a ground turkey, um, do some ground turkey with these beans. Um, I normally like to get the no salt beans, but they didn't have any. And then on top of that, I mean, the other refried beans are the same calories. So what I do is I do add a little bit of water to them. Um, and it kind of spreads it out more. So I think I got three cans of those. I just got a no salt tomato sauce just to have. Um, and then this guy, I saw somebody on Instagram yesterday who did some chicken breast in the cro crock pot. She poured this on it while it cooked. And then afterwards she added corn and black beans to it. It was almost like an enchilada chili. So I think I want to try that. 
So there's that. There's the corn for that. And then let me switch over to the other side. Okay, so let's start over here. So I got these soups. <laughs> Sorry, I almost forgot the name of that. Um, I got two of the same ones. They're the hot and spicy chicken flavor. Buns likes these. The only thing that I have against these is, man, they make the house smell. So I got those for him. And then I got these for Albert. He likes chow mein. Um, so I wanted to give him something you know, new to try. And then for our diet, at least me, I know Buns likes the caramel ones. Um, sorry, the camera was getting a little heavy. But I got these rice cakes. This one is white cheddar and it's only 45 calories for one. So that's a good snack. And then when you want something sweet, I got the caramel ones also. So those are good snacks. I like having those. Buns actually just got into the caramel ones. And then um, I've got some light mayonnaise, some light sour cream, light or reduced sugar strawberry jam, jelly. Um, this is really good when you have a sweet tooth. I do one of those breads with a little bit of this on there and it's really good. Um, I got some sun-dried tomatoes. Honestly, I'm not sure why. <laughs> maybe to do with like a chicken or something, but I kind of wanted, you know, change up some of the things that we eat. I feel like we eat a lot of the same thing all the time. Um, I got some watermelon. Buns really, really loves watermelon, so every time we go to the store, we try to get watermelon. I got two different cheeses. Um, now, I will say I do like to shred my own cheese. Um, and I can grab that real quick. So for my pizzas, I do have a cheese I'm gonna shred. It's for those. Um, but then I just like to have these on hand just in case like with beans, buns likes me to put cheese on top of them. So I always try to have cheese with me. Um, I got these little potatoes. These are really good. Um, and calorie wise, I don't think they're terrible. So 80 calories for one fourth of this whole thing. So that's pretty good. So if you were to do a serving of that and then like a chicken breast, that would be a really good meal. Um, I got these little tuna things. So I was telling you guys about Buns' tuna that he likes. Well, I was not a big tuna person, but I actually found these little cups. And you can kind of see the tuna in there. These are really good. Now, I've never tried the other flavors, but this lemon and thyme, definitely recommend these. They are small. I mean, I think I paid like $1.99 for it, but the flavor is so good. Um, I did get these little mini bell peppers. I was going to get regular bell peppers, but they were a little on the pricey side. They were, I think, like $6.99 for four bell peppers. And this little bag of mini bell peppers was like $2.99. So it comes with two colors of each, just no green, which that's cool. I mean, Buns is really the only one that eats them. So $2.99 for that, not bad. Um, I got this guy. So this is a breakfast burrito. Um, this is not for me. Maybe buns if he wants one um, because again, he's not on a strict diet like I'm going to be. Um, but mostly I got these for Albert and P. Um, they like breakfast burritos. So I do work from home some days. P does go to a babysitter's but on the weekends if they wake up and they want something then they can grab those. I also got this Marie Callender's chicken alfredo bowl. Um... I just got this for Albert. Most of the stuff in the freezer section was starting to go. And I don't know if I've said this already, but tonight at midnight, California, at least Southern California, is going on another stay-at-home order. So things are starting to sell out. Um, this was one I'm actually glad I found because Walmart is almost always out of these. And this was actually the last two bags at Stater Brothers. So I grabbed these. If you guys know, you know. Um, this is what I use for breakfast. I do like whatever the serving is. Um, egg whites and then ham. And I'll show you guys the other stuff. Um, these. Oh, I really like these. Now, Buns didn't care for these. He does like the macaroni and cheese one. Um, but these things are really good. So these are the Rotini Alfredo. The pasta is actually made with vegetables, and there it is right there. Um, really, really good. 170 calories 
for a serving um, and a serving size is one and one fourths frozen or a half a cup cook. Um, and there's only two, two and a half servings in here. So the last time we bought this, I think me, buns and pea actually divided it. So this calories was even a little bit less than that. And I feel like I'm about to sneeze. Um, got some broccoli, We've got some limes. Limes are so expensive at Stater Brothers. Cilantro, I feel like I always need cilantro. Um, a head of lettuce, this is something I normally don't buy, but I wanted to just in case I needed lettuce for something. I got some zucchini, some croutons. These are kind of like our salad fillers. So buns like croutons, I don't. I feel like it's kind of a waste of calories. Um, he also likes the blueberries and, and cranberries, so I got those. And then these are my salad fillers. These are the little Parmesan crisps. They're really good. Um, I got some soy chorizo. Um, I, I don't know if this is the good brand or not. I feel like it is. But one of my employees that used to work for me, um, I had told her that I had tried soy chorizo once. It was kind of gross. She said I was trying the wrong one. So I really feel like this is it, but we'll see. Um, these are the hams that I use for my breakfast. So I just got four of those. I think I use sometimes half, sometimes whole, um, which isn't bad because the whole package is only 90 calories, if you guys can see that. Um, turkey bacon, mushrooms. And then macaroni and cheese. Buns really likes macaroni and cheese, especially like the animal type shapes. Um, they're a little bit pricier in the organic section, um, but I got those. Got those ones too. I got these two jellos. I guess they're kind of backwards, but I really like these jellos. These ones are my favorite. They're the strawberry kiwi. 10 calories, not bad. Um, and then, of course, I like crunched this box, but I got, these are my favorite. Um, they're 280 calories. The Vermont cheese one is good. They do have a yellow cheese that's really gross. Um, but I got those. I got um, Santa Fe style rice and beans. I love rice, so I got that. This one is for buns. It's just a little pizza. And then one more of those. I don't know if I showed you mushrooms, but we got some mushrooms. We got, I've never tried this, but I'm, I kind of want to. It is mashed cauliflower. This one has roasted garlic. They did have one that was just plain, but I figure I like roasted garlic. So we'll try that one. So I've got that. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to speed through this real quick because Buns is hungry and this is long. Um, I got some pork chops. We don't do a lot of pork. But I figure it's a good alternative. They were $6.43, so there's four good looking pork chops. I do cut the fat off of them. I'm very picky when it comes to fat. Got some chicken breast, it's four pieces. Total was $7.72, so we'll figure out what I do with those. And then I got hearts of romaine and also a shredded lettuce. So I'll put those together when I make a salad and I'll actually um, chop them up together. I did get some chicken tenders. I like doing these in the air fryer with a little bit of Lowry sauce on them. And then these I'm really excited for. So we have discovered the broccoli cheddar soup from Panera. Now we really don't go to Panera. We've been to Panera once. We didn't find it all that great. Um, but one day, I think like last week, I was kind of craving some broccoli cheddar soup. So I saw it at Target, I picked it up, fell in love with it. And then went into Stater Brothers and I saw clam chowder. Now, I think clam chowder is good. I did try it for the first time, I think in Florida maybe. Um, and it ended up really being good. So I got that and then I also got a lobster bisque. Now, Buns and I, I don't think either one of us have ever had lobster bisque, um, but we're excited to try it. We've got some Doritos because my family is a Dorito family and I got some poppables pretty much just to eat for today um, before I start diet. So I start diet tomorrow. I'm going to try and not pig out, but I did buy a couple things to enjoy before we go on our diet. Um, excuse me, I've got a little bit of a runny nose. I got some onions. I left them in the bag because they're kind of shedding. I've got, so 
one of the things that really helps me get through my diet is drinks. So I'm not a huge soda drinker, um, but I do like juice. So I found these juices. I always have to have them on hand. Um, they are the Minute Maid Zero Sugar. This is my favorite. The Mango Passion is amazing. Um, but it is five calories for eight ounces. So normally I think my glasses are, I don't have any glasses up here. I do use this little glass, so this is eight ounces. Um, if not, I do use a 16 ounce glass, but 10 calories is not gonna kill me. So that one's my favorite. I do like to switch it up a little bit, so I get this fruit punch. And then on top of that, I was able to find Buns a orange juice that he actually likes that is low calories. So this one is 50 calories and it tastes really good. I think it actually tastes better than like all the other ones I've had. These are my egg whites. So you guys know breakfast, egg whites, ham, potatoes, all that jazz. Did get a Hidden Valley Light Ranch. I don't care for that one, but the one that I normally get, I can only get it at Walmart or Albertsons. I think it's like Skinny Lady or something like that. Um, but I also got a can of Albondias. Buns really liked these. Um, I think I made it for him about two weeks ago. I said the flavor is really good. I got some more of this. I think I showed you guys already one tomato sauce. And then here's the other Rayos. This one is four cheese. And then black beans. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but this is a barbecue sauce that I found. It is a sweet and tangy bourbon. So I'm excited to try that. I think I'm actually going to do it today. I have a pack of carnitas that I need to warm up and if you don't know um carnitas is actually just pulled pork pretty much so I'm gonna warm that up and then maybe pour some of this on it and then <laughs> because I was totally influenced um I got the better than boyan jar um I do use the flavored or the powder Boyan, but I've seen so many influencers use this and of course I'm a sucker for it um, So I got this one. This is the roasted garlic. Um, they didn't have the chicken one But I'll see what you know, I can do with this. I can probably put it in some raw rice or oh You know what it might even go good in that cauliflower. So I got this I'm gonna get the chicken one next time when they have it and then I got two more things I got this cheese. Now I'm a cheese freak. I got a thing of Gouda cheese from Aldi last week and I ate in like two days. It was smaller than this though, but I got this one to try. This is going to be like my guilty pleasure for today. Um, and then the last thing, totally didn't need it, <laughs> but it's totally adorable. I got this cute little poinsettia. Um, it was... $6.77, kind of pricey for one little poinsettia, but, you know, add glitter to it, and I'm obsessed. So, this guy's got to come out of here. Um, I'm, I'm a little late on decorating. The last two weeks, Buns has been home because he hurt his back real bad, and so I've just kind of been working from home and catering to him as much as I can. Um, so, I haven't really done anything housewise. So this has got to go. Those two things are probably going to go. They're more springish. Um, and then I'm going to pull back. You guys are going to see life <laughs> in my kitchen. Um, but so all of these have got to come down. I do have like a full on Christmas display that I put up here. Um, but then I got to clean. <laughs> So here's real life. Normally when I record for you guys, my kitchen is clean and spotless. We have been out the last two days. Um, so I will say everything that's in here, that's all clean. Um, I just didn't get a chance to put it away because I washed it before we left. The stuff in there is dirty. It's from my stepson. He does not like to wash his dishes apparently. Although I will say I have been using the dishwasher, which I think is semi-full. So he did take some bowls out to use, but I'll put that away um, and kind of restock that. I need to clean that. I have bacon that I had made. 
um, that I guess he didn't eat. And then bread air fryer needs to get put away. But that is this haul. I'm not going to make this any longer. Um, I'm hoping that maybe I can get another video in about something else. I don't know what. But let me flip you guys around so I can say goodbye. All right. So that was hopefully pretty quick. Um, I know I normally do my grocery hauls and then I go into something else. But I just wanted to do a quick grocery haul. Show you guys what $330 looks like at Stater Brothers. Um, I'm going to try to avoid shopping there again. It was just too much. I mean, I know if I had gone to Walmart, it still would have been like 200 bucks, but for a four person family, um, and then on top of that, like some of the specialty stuff that we got, cause we're going onto a diet. Um, it's, it's okay. I would have much better preferred, you know, 200 rather than 300, but Hope you guys enjoyed, um, just groceries, I know, but I like to share parts of my life with you guys, um, and if you guys need any ideas on what to get if you guys are trying to do some low calorie stuff, hopefully I gave you guys some good ideas, so thank you, um, if you have not, go check out my Instagram, um, it is mostly beauty related, um, I did put a quick face on today, although I'm looking pretty pale, um, I'm kind of in between colors right now because my winter tan, not my winter tan, my summer tan is gone. So now we are pale Ashley for the winter. Um, so I do need to find some new makeup um, and I need to work on this double chin. But thanks for stopping by. Hope you guys like and subscribe and go check out my Instagram. I am considering making a second Instagram. I'm thinking of doing like a losing Ashley Instagram, um, but I've got to be really, really, really committed to this diet to do that. So we'll see. Anyways, thanks again. Love you guys. Bye.